access coverage of the 14th Annual Interactive Achievement Awards. Who knows what's gonna happen? If we win this year, I'm gonna go nuts. In a matter of moments, I'll be on stage doing jokes, monologue material about video games. And you may say, how could that possibly be funny? It might not be. <laughs> That's the high wire act that is this show. This is uh, the next best thing to being in space, is being right here. I love this awards show. Video Games Biggest Night starts right now. In case of emergency, 911 calls him. His ear once bit Mike Tyson. When you open up a can of whoop ass, he jumps out. He once killed two stones with one bird. He lives vicariously through himself. He is What? Did Cut. you miss me? Cut! Cut! Are you kidding me? Are you stealing from beer commercials now? Wasn't enough to piss off Bruce Campbell, was it? You just had to go there. Listen, now that you're at Gearbox Software, we've got to get you out there, man. That's why the suits hired me to do your PR, right? Right! And Duke, Duke, babe, you can't just be gone for over a dozen years and then think you can come back after all this time and just give us a high. You want to bet? Hail to the king, baby. Ah, there it is again. Duke, look at all the people out there. These people are all with the Academy of Interactive Arts and Sciences. They're not here to see you, Duke. They're here to see Jay Moore. And they decide which video games each year are the best. They're all dressed up tonight because it's the 2011 Interactive Achievement Award Show. An award that you are going to want next year. I've got plenty of awards. 9,000 Vaporware of the Year Awards do not count. Duke, what I'm trying to tell you is you've got to play ball. You've got to look at what this year's nominees did and be more like them. Take Game of the Year nominee Red Dead Redemption. You've played it, right? Right. Well, it's about the Wild West, family, and personal sacrifice. It's subtle and surprisingly emotional. Do you have anything like that in your game? You mean like this? Check this. Hell, I'd still hit it. God, you can't combine monsters and boobs, Duke. Who does that? Anyway, next is Halo Reach. Don't make a reach around joke, okay? Fine. Let's see what you've got for Halo. Roll the footage. Time to move on. Got your green power armor over here and ready to go. Power armor is for pussies. Um, well, okay. Uh, you, you want a gun instead? Uh, you just don't get it. This is serious business. You can't insult Shut one of the greatest science fiction video game the... series of all time and get away with that. You get the nerve to do uh. something like that. Yeah, that deserves an award. Welcome to the 14th Annual Interactive Achievement Awards. Now please welcome your host, Jay Moore. Thank you very much, everybody. Hello, friends. It's great to be back here hosting the Interactive Achievement Awards. It's my sixth time. This is crazy. 
the Interactive Video Game Achievement Awards, or as I call it these days, my primary source of income. <laughs> I want to thank Gearbox and uh, Duke Nukem for that badass opening. That was cool as hell. Yeah. Little known fact, it took them 15 years to make that tiny little video. <laughs> now the game should actually be coming out around the same time as Universal Healthcare, the next Hobbit movie, flying cars, and whenever Lindsay Lohan decides to return a necklace. <laughs> Long time from now. I say it every year and I'll say it again and I'll say it now because at the end of the show everyone's had some cocktails and it's hard for me to convey how genuine my feelings are. I will never be as good at any of the jobs I have as you guys are at yours. So please give yourselves a round of applause. You this is like the cream of the crop of the industry. We're here now. Hey, we are on G4 this year. Yes! It's a great network, G4. It's an up and comer, it's a player. And they're really into all the work that we're doing and the work that we're rewarding tonight. In hindsight, you know what? G4 is a network, it's where we've always belonged. In the past, maybe we made a few mistakes. Maybe Telemundo last year wasn't the best idea. <laughs> that wasn't so good. Salvador Gigante, din din din, Assassin's Creed, me yours, stab stab. Not the best one. We gotta talk about Call of Duty Black Ops, right? Three, this is amazing. You guys, 360 million in one day? One billion dollars in its first six weeks? Amazing! And congratulations, Activision. It's the biggest game since the last one you made. <laughs> Activision, you're like James Cameron. You make one record-breaking hit after another and absolutely nobody wants to work with you. Xbox 360 released its brand new controller, the Kinect. PlayStation 3 started offering games in stereoscopic 3D, and the geniuses over at Wii made a red one. <laughs> Come on, Nintendo! Try! Are you guys ready to get this thing going or what? Let's hear it. Let's get the energy up. All right. Terrific, terrific, terrific. To present our first awards of the evening, hands down the sexiest presenter that's going to grace our stage tonight, and his pal, Morgan Webb. Please welcome the president and CEO of Insomniac Games, the guy behind Ratchet and Resistance, my buddy Ted Price, and G4's own Morgan Webb, everybody. Give him a big round of applause, please. Keep it clapping. Here they come. Watch your step, Teddy. All right. We are honored to get you guys started on the awards tonight. Uh, the discs and game cases strewn in front of your typical gamer's television have become, in recent years, comparable to any gallery, symposium, or film retrospective. Games like paintings, like sculptures, like the best of literature, music, or film are art. And as such, they represent the culmination of tireless work by true artists. Here are this year's nominees and winners for Outstanding Achievement in Visual and Performance Art. The nominees for Outstanding Achievement in Animation are... Ready when you are. Call of Duty Black Ops. Enslaved Odyssey to the West. Yes! You made it stop! <laughs> God of War 3. Red Dead Redemption. Don't let them get away with it. Tom Clancy's Winter Cell Conviction. And the winner is. God of War 3 by SCE Santa Monica Studio and Sony Computer Entertainment America. The nominees for Outstanding Achievement in Art Direction are... Alan Wake.
slave, Odyssey to the West. If you die, I die. I ain't gonna let that happen. God of War 3. Born from the depths of the underworld. Kirby's Epic Yarn. I'm coming out! Don't shoot! Red Dead Redemption. And the winner is... Red Dead Redemption by Rockstar San Diego and Rockstar Games. The nominees for Outstanding Achievement Visual Engineering are... Call of Duty Black Ops. Live in a world where seeing is not believing. God of War 3. Get out of the way! Heavy Rain. Medal of Honor. Metro 2033. And the winner is Heavy Rain, Quantic Dream Studio and Sony Computer Entertainment America. Don't go anywhere, things are just getting started. Awards for Best MMO slash RPG, Action, Adventure and many more are coming up. We'll be right back. <laughs>